Welcome, welcome. Happy Friday, everyone. How are you guys all doing? Happy Friday. How's your week? Are you glad that it's Friday and it's going to be the weekend? Because yes, I am. I am so glad to be here. So glad to be here with you guys. Are you guys crafting with me tonight? Are you excited to talk about the details of this cutie patootie? Hello, everyone. Let's start with my mom. <laughs> Hi, mom. <laughs> Thank you for being here so early. Hi, Bobby. How are you? How are you guys? I'm just putting a little bit of lotion. Who else do we have today? Hello, hello, hello. Um, Davina, wait. Pink, pink Crafty World. Is that Maria? Pink Crafty World. Is that Maria? Hello, guys. I'm sorry. The texts are delayed. Hello, Elaine. Hi, Bex. Hi, Robin. Hi, Carol. Hi, Jeannie. Hello, Miss Alvina. Pink Crafty World is Maria, guys. Don't forget. Hi, Patricia V. Happy Friday. Alicia, hello. Yes, you made it on time. You are perfect timing. Hello, Hillary. How are you? How was your week? Hello, Carol. Hey, Nancy, you're back. Hello, Misty. How is everybody doing today? How? Hi, Cruz. <laughs> Hi, PJ. How are you? Hi, Ina. Thanks for being here. Thank you. Thank you for the cute toaster. Sorry, I'm putting lotion on. Because I have um, I have work hands. Hi, Christian's mom. Thank you, Jeannie. That's my mama. I was chatting with her. I was chatting with her today, and I said, "Mom, you have to come. What if somebody people don't show up?" So I had my mom. <laughs> At least I have one viewer. <laughs> Hi, Shanita. End of the week. Are you excited to be off? Oh my gosh. Hi, Robin. So hello everybody today. So you already know that the tutorial is available for this. It is already out there. Um, but I want us to kind of put it together. And if you have any questions about the measurements, I want to take the opportunity to kind of tackle that today. Hi, Tracy. Hello, Mindy. How are you guys? How are you guys? Thank you so much. And it's so much space. That you can put in here it's so spacious inside it's a perfect receptacle for your gift hi Cheska. so this we're going to talk about a lot of techniques today there's so many there's so many things you can put in here you guys like it is four inches deep four inches like the thickness of it like i was just trying to see what what can fit in it but there are so many things. Uh, my suggestion for you is you have to make it sturdy. Because the size of this, since the size is huge, you want to be able to put a lot of craft goodies inside. And so I suggest that you make it sturdy. Sturdy. Hi, Kayla. Happy Friday. Hello, Miss Bonnie. Happy Friday, everyone. So it is cute. This perfect. You can make it whatever season. This would be cute for a Mother's Day present, don't you think? Like you can put a cookbook inside or a recipe book for your mom or a mother or any kind of friend. I think I think it's going to be amazing. So we're going to be talking about some techniques tonight. Um, like one specific technique I want to talk to you guys about. This is inspired by my friend Lizette, who is Fufusha Dolls. Hi, Deb. So this, we're going to talk about... Hi, Patrice. Hi, Carol. Oh, Candice, you made it. I'm doing jewelry, but I'm here listening. Okay, cool. Very good. Hi, Lenny. You're back. So this one is just, you know, those... Um, the one that I showed you during my, um, my haul video. Whoopsies. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry, you guys. So sorry. <laughs> it's like an earthquake. It's not an earthquake. I bumped into my table. Um, sorry, there's no earthquake here. We're good. But I wanna I wanted to find it. This is the um, the foam sheet. That's the foam sheet I was looking for. Hi Christina. Yes, Candace, we missed you, honey. How you doing? Candace is my doodlebug sister. 
So this is what we're going to be making. This is what we're going to use to create these. And they're sturdy here. Let me show you. And then you zap it with a heat gun. Um, Lizette's technique is to iron it. I don't have access to my ironing board. I don't have space for it. But Rachel told me she you can zap it and then it worked. It just worked. Thank you. Thank you, Christina. Hi, Kiko. Hi, Carla. How are you? So, so Lanny is back, you guys. Lanny's back. Hi, Scrappy Nerd. How are you? Love me some doodle bug. I know, guys. I love doodle bug so much. I just can't. Anywho, so let's start. I did some pre-work. Um, since you already know how to create, there's already a tutorial out there. I don't want to double up. I just want to tell you that there's an update, okay? There's an update to the feet. Before, we just used the gold. So I just, um, I just figure out a way to do the feet. I think it's more professional, professionally looking, toaster looking. <laughs> you know what I mean. Hi, Connie. Happy Friday. I'm doing well. Miss you ladies too. I'm so busy with work for several months. Ooh, yes, girl. I know. We understand, girl. Whenever you're free, we're just here, you know. <laughs> but I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy for you, Candice. It's it's good. I'm, I'm, I'm happy that that is happening in your life. Hi, Avina. I have done that technique before with the flowers, and I love it. I've never seen it before. I am so excited to have found Lizette's tutorial. It is amazing. Where do I find the tutorial for the toaster? Um, let me see. I think I put a link. I put a link in my previous video, actually. Carol, if you look at my toaster project share, the link is there. And then in this video, I put the measurements and everything for you. Hi, Maddie. Happy Friday. Yes, Christina, I'm so happy you're back on the Friday. Yes. Okay, so the measurements is in the description box of the video you're watching right now. And on my previous video, it has the link to the video and it also has a link. It also has in the description box everything that you're going to need. So let's get started so we can get through this and finish the project. Okay. Um, let me put my lotion aside because, because, okay, so I've prepped everything. Okay. So this one, for this tutorial, you're going to need four sheets of the six by eight. Four sheets. One will be the inside part and one would be the outside portion. Hello, Erica. How are you? Sorry, I wasn't looking at the comments. Hi, Rach. How are you? So glad that you guys are here today. Thanks for being here. I'm so glad that he spoils you, Candace. You want to say hi, Nick? Hello. Thank you, Nico. Hello. Thank you. Um, thanks, Deb, for linking. I I appreciate it so much. Um, thank you so much for being here, everyone. I appreciate you guys. Um, so this you're gonna need two sheets. So just just the base. Don't consider the decorative part. Okay, that's just. That's just a bonus. But the basic creation of this is just the base, which is this is six by eight. Okay. Six by eight. Two of this because this is going to be the outside and the other six by eight is going to be the inside portion. So I took the liberty of um, putting them all together. So we're going to start. Um, and this one is a five by 16 inches. What I suggest for you to do is I suggest that you decorate it first before you attach them together just to be on the safe side. Thank you, Erica, for being here. Thank you, everyone, for being here. I know that we're all fans of Erica. <laughs> Hi, Tamara. Oh, my gosh. Hello, Tamara. How are you? So I'm just putting some folds and having this... So you're going to see that there are score marks. It helps facilitate the folding. So what I'm doing right now is I'm pretty much just putting it together. I think this, this paper I am in love, in love, in love, in love with. I'm just in love with it. I drank half a bottle of wine. I'm not sure how long. 
I will last tonight. No problem, Tamara. <laughs> you can just rewatch it. <laughs> oh, we just had our pizza delivered. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I wanted to do some pizza tonight, but I didn't have time. I thought I could order from Pizza Hut, but the store that I normally order, oh my gosh, it's closed. Is that crazy? So my Pizza Hut local branch is closed. So I wanted some Pizza Hut and I wanted some stuffed crust pizza. And then they have the nicest Alfredo pasta. It's so good. Oh, you made pizza and wings yourself? Look at you, the chef, Shanita. Hi, Pia. Welcome, welcome. Wow, that's amazing. Hi, Alondra. How are you? Welcome, welcome. So we're just putting the things together just so we can take time with the new techniques that we're doing. So I was like really, really trying to prep. I worked last night until, well, I got home about four mm -hmm. or 10 minutes before four. So I did some of the cutting last night and and the scoring. No, I think I scored this this today. Hi, cousin Sandra. How are you? Thanks for being here. Um, chat is chat is flying. Very impressive. I know, right? I had leftover pork chops today. I saw Christian post a live. I was like, nope, not cooking. <laughs> Kayla, you're so sweet. <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm glad you guys are here because we're going to be talking about some techniques. And my I, I showed my husband the toaster and he's like, he's really, really bothered by, you know, the handle, the side handle. He's bothered that it doesn't move. So I'm going to try something. I don't know if it works. This one, he's like bothered. Like, why is it not moving? Why can't you go put it up and down? And I'm like, because it's... It's just pretend toaster. It's like, no, you, I'm sure you can try. <laughs> so now I'm thinking, I've been thinking since yesterday, how am I going to make that thing move? And he was like, can you, um, can you store a Pop-Tart? Like actually be able to put a Pop-Tart inside? He's like, I don't know. Jules, I don't have time. <laughs> Hi, Kathy. Hi, Kathy. Welcome, welcome. Thank you. Thank you so much for being here. Welcome to the crafty community. So glad you're here. Welcome, guys. Welcome, Kathy, to the crafty community. She's new. Hi, Claudia. How are you, girl? He wants, yes, he wants a working toaster. That is cute. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Hi, Penny. Happy Friday. <laughs> Half a bottle of wine. Yes. Hi, Christine. Happy Friday. How are you? Jacqueline. A zipper on the handle. I was thinking of a brad. So I was experimenting on a brad. And we're going to see if that works. Because I just did this one. Hi Inez. How are you? Thanks for being here you guys. So I was thinking of a brad. That goes up and down. And then. But I need to make sure. I, I think I need to cut. So this is my thought process. I need to cut this. So it still goes up and down. So I need to definitely cut this. I'm not sure if this is the right tool. But I'm going to have to cut it. And then I'm going to have to kind of use like double-sided tape or whatever. Or I don't know. That's why I'm not sure about what I'm going to do. But, you know, it's still we can all make suggestions. And I don't know. We'll see. There are other toasters that I can play with. Actually, I did like a factory worker mode last night and I prepped for four toasters. Oh my gosh. Hi, Bex. Did I say hi to you, Bex? I want to make sure. Um, hi, Veronica. How are you? I'm just arriving from at Walmart. So I'm here, but also shopping. Let us know if there's anything good at Walmart. We love Walmart. So I think this is what I'm going to do. Hopefully it doesn't come apart, but... It's not very secure. That's the problem. It just has to move up. I think the zipper is a great idea. Bex, I think I, who told me about the zipper? I don't know, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Anyways, so I was thinking attaching, look at this perfect flare I found that um, Bona sent me. Isn't this the most perfect flare? It's like a toaster flare for a toaster. 
cute, right? <laughs> Hi, Clarissa. Welcome, welcome. Hello. Thank you, you guys, for being here. I appreciate you guys. Hanging out on a Friday since we can't go to the club. As if I go to the club. <laughs> but, you know, you know what I mean. <laughs> Hi, Patrice. Did I say hi to you already? Hi, Tess. How are you? Glad you're here today. So, yes, this is the club, honey. That's what we're talking about. We are making a toaster tonight, Clarissa, right here. I saw count. What did I, did I name her Tracy or Brenda? I forget. Do you guys remember what I named her? <laughs> Thank you, Erica. <laughs> so, I forget, but... Brenda. Okay. So her name is Brenda. This is Brenda. And then we're going to get a new toaster and I don't know her name yet. We got to we got to check out her face, her facial features and everything, the color combinations and then we can see what is appropriate. What is an appropriate name for our new toaster? Brenda is going to go to I'm going to give Brenda to my friend Michelle, who is the owner of Three Crafts Chicks. I think it's time for me to send her a present. Um, Clarissa, this is made using your paper trimmer and your scoring tool. Um, yeah, it's not an SVG file. There is an SVG file for this. Um, this is inspired by the amazing Jen Beeson. And, and sh I saw her... I saw her make this from um, from the Doodle Doodlebug blog, but the amazing Jen. I put her I put her link um, in my previous video when I showcased this product. But there is a file. But right now, hi hi Mimi. But right now we are um, we are creating it manually for the people who don't have a cutting cutting machine um so you can choose if you want to do like a file or a um just manually do it yourself loving it i'm definitely going to try this trying out of my box yes girl it's so much fun i didn't see what you use for the sprinkles for the pop tarts the pop tarts i use nouveau drops claudia Plain old Nouveau drops. I think if you want it a little bit more dimensional, after it dries, you can double it up, and that's gonna, that's gonna really, really make it pop. Yes. Good job, Tess. Yes. Did you use the coupon PHA ten because, because that is your benefit being part of this crafty community. Hey guys, if you hopped in and I forgot to say hi to you, let me know because definitely I want to acknowledge everyone that's here. We're all part of this crafty community, having fun, hanging out. Um, and we want to welcome you. Hi, Gina. How are you, Gina? Hi, Eve. How are you? Thank you, Eve. Hello, crafty friends. Hello, Miss Wendy. We are all inspired by your felt goodies. Love it so much so cute because i only own a cutter and a scoring board and a die cutting machine girl this project is perfect for you then hello hi crystal how are you hello at work but want to watch yes stay here as long as you can <laughs> as long as your boss doesn't see you stay have fun with us on this friday i just want to make sure that it's centered one, two, one, two. Okay. So just want to make sure that it's centered. Make sure that your orientation is correct. You know what I mean? So yes. Okay, let me. Hi, Michelle. Welcome. How are you? Happy Friday to you. Hello, Marble Knight. Happy Friday. I'm so glad that you guys are here today. Um, so I want to make sure that it's stuck because look how pretty that is on top. And then I'm going to like, that's why I put a lot of like tape in there just to make sure that it sticks. 
and then we're going to reinforce it with our glue gun for example like this part this like if it's if it's kind of sloughing off like that that is the job for your glue gun okay make sure that your glue gun is hot and ready to go like a pizza like a little caesar's pizza hot and ready you know nouveau drops you wanted use on project life was ruby slippers it's glitter nouveau what will you talk me into must haves tonight absolutely nothing michelle tonight we are going to use what we have is brenda decorative or does she have a function girl Tamara, she does have a function brenda is your friend if you want to use it as storage let me show you the features of brenda hello cousin olga how are you okay let me put you up top you're gonna see my crafty messy table but that's okay so guys, this is Brenda. She is our initial feature for tonight's show, okay? Brenda contains your favorite crafty tools. If you want to send some presents to your friends, to your mother, to your cousins, you know, you can put a t-shirt, you can put socks, you can put, don't put Nouveau Drops, it's going to be too heavy. But Brenda can accommodate so many cute things. Brenda can store. Brenda can store some sprinkles. Brenda can store sprinkle mix. Brenda can store your felt. Your shakers. Brenda can store a lot. Brenda is cute and functional. Brenda can store a memory deck. Yeah, Brenda can be a memory deck holder. Oh my God. Bobby, genius. <laughs> Brenda is amazing. She will help you organize your crafty things. What else can Brenda have? Brenda can have a measuring tape. Oh, Brenda can store some yarn. Oh my gosh. Look how cute Brenda can have all the yarn inside. If you want to share yarn, if you want to share felt. <laughs> all we need, we all need a Brenda. Yes. <laughs> Brenda is a toaster. Brenda is an organizer disguised as a toaster. You know what I mean? She's so cute. And she wants to come to your craft room. This <laughs> Brenda does dishes. <laughs> Damn, you're so funny. Brenda's nails are like pristine. She, she's not going to touch any of that. But look, Brenda can... This is huge, okay? Brenda can accommodate this big old... Look how spacious that is. I <laughs> just saw all the measurements. Clarissa, I would start with... I would start with non-decorative. Don't do decorative just yet. Just think of it as an outer layer and an inner layer. Okay? Don't just just make a prototype. Nothing major. <laughs> Who wants a Brenda? <laughs> you can make your own Brenda and you can definitely, guys, it is super, super. It's not super easy. It's kind of like um not advanced. It's like an intermediate uh project. Okay, intermediate skill level because you're gonna have to like really measure and everything but the look at that you get brenda in your craft room does brenda come with a warranty for male purposes <laughs> that's funny yes brenda will be protected oh my god hi tana i didn't see you there hi veronica hi palm sorry i was talking too much you know that's what happens when you talk too much. Hi, Jenny. Carla, did I say hi to you already? I hope I did. Anywho, so now that you guys seen the feature of features of Brenda, not only is she gorgeous, not only is she very floral, and she can be whatever you want her to be, Brenda is gorgeous, and she can be an organizer, she can be an MDC holder, she can hold whatever you like. Is Lizette here? Hi, Lizette. If you're here, I have a technique that I'm using a technique that you um that you showed us. Thank you so much. Hello, Josie. Hello, Lorene. Welcome, welcome. I'm so glad you guys are here. <laughs> yes. So 
right? They are... Hi, Veronica! We have two Veronicas. VLC is Veronica. Scrapaholic is Veronica. Hello, Lex. How are you doing, Lex? Hello, Paula. I love that you guys are here. Thank you for being here. Oh, my gosh. It's going to be a fun night. VLC is Vero. Okay, is that, is that how we're differentiating it? Okay. Vero and Veronica. Okay. So, I think that... I think that you are all convinced that Brenda is amazing. I think there's no doubt. <laughs> yes, Jenny. Okay, I think we have no doubts that Brenda is amazing and we love her so much. <laughs> you, you, and you get a Brenda for now. For limited amount of time available. Great organizer to hide your hordes. <laughs> Cannot resist. They will not stay long on the shelf. <laughs> So cute. Lost track of everyone. <laughs> Hello, everyone, and welcome. Hi, Ginger. Hello. How are you? I am Ginger from Tennessee. I want to be your friend. I want to be friend. <laughs> so cute. Welcome. Welcome, Ginger. <laughs> you can make many, many Brendas if you want. <laughs> I scream, Brenda. You scream, I want one. <laughs> Brenda is the toaster. Yes, Mimi. <laughs> Hi, Helen. How are you? Welcome, welcome. Happy Friday. I seen on YouTube. Carol, that's funny. <laughs> we all want Brenda. Oh, my God. <laughs> Paula, I know. I got some new perler beads. I'm excited to bake them. Anywho, let's go back to the construction. Now that you guys, now that you guys know that you need a Brenda in your life. So, yes, we do. Brenda does not do dishes. Yes. Unfortunately, no. Brenda don't do no dishes, okay? Because she's just pretty and no, she doesn't do dishes. She she refused. I asked and she said, girl, no. Girl, no, that is not my jam. So I'm just trying to get this. Brenda for president? What? <laughs> so funny. <laughs> Girl, we're good. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> For prime minister, that's cute. She'll fall apart, literally. <laughs> yeah, she'll fall apart if you make her wash the dishes. But she can help you organize your, maybe your perler, perler bead stash. But make sure, if you're going to make Brenda, make sure that you make her sturdy if you have intentions of putting heavy things inside her, Okay. Because it's not fair for her if you make it if you make her using wobbly material. So I am so excited to see your Brenda's, you guys. Trophy craft. Uh, just so you know the fact the chat is fast. I know, right? Perler beads came out looking like ants. Oh my god, how cute is? Are they cute? Hello, Em. How are you, Em? Thanks for being here. <laughs> so that's that. Um, I think I need to get be on top of the business because I'm like, I'm like behind. Gotta gotta work faster. I'm just chatting so much that I'm not efficient. Sorry, sorry. I'm glad you're here, Em. If you put foam board inside the bottom, it should make it stronger. That's a great idea. That's a great idea. Bex. This is our bottom. So I'm just putting the decorative piece on there. Just to make it cured. Just to make it cured. We're just putting all the cute pieces part. So that when we put it together, it's going to be a ta-da. I wonder how long it would take for perler beads to melt if you were on the beach. It <laughs> depends on where it is. Is Brenda covered in doodlebug paper? Yes. Yes, honey. Doodlebug paper. Yes. This is my favorite line of all time. What about the doodlebug lovers in the house? What about you guys? What's your favorite doodlebug collection if you like doodlebug? I think this is my number one. This is just crazy. How long? Too long without the Christian life. <laughs> I'm 
Yes, depends if you're in Florida. Sounds good. I like the Halloween doodle bug collections. They are so cute, aren't they? Cream and sugar and made with love. Yes, Jenny. It's so hard to get cream and sugar anymore. So glad I hoarded those. <clears throat> doodle bug fan. I am loving made with love. Girl, a girl, yes. Hi, Lori. Lori, thank you for being here. On a Friday night. Yes. <laughs> I've always liked Doodlebug. It's the first collection. Ah, I love Doodlebug so much. It looks like we're all loving the same exact things. Like the cream and sugar and the made with love. Because there's no, there's no season for it. You can use it for whatever, right? You could use it for Mother's Day. You can use it for whatevs. That's why it's so perfect. <laughs> yes, honey, yes. <laughs> honey. <laughs> yes, honey. <laughs> this one, it's optional for you to decorate it. You don't have to if you don't want to. But it is an option if you want to. You can cover it and make it all pretty. I'm not going to make it pretty just so um, we're going to be kind of efficient. So let's put it all together. Again, before you assemble it, you have to be mindful. Am I going to be putting a boatload of beads in here? Or am I going to put like felt or whatever? Because that should kind of help you determine how sturdy it should be. Oh, Laurie, we are making Brenda. Brenda is our ambassador for Doodlebug Made With Love. Okay. So she is a toaster. She's disguised as a toaster, but she is technically an organizer. She will help you in your craft room. Oh, yes. French kiss is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Guys, don't forget that I they there is, I think there is a file for this. Okay. So if you don't want to make it manually, no pressure. That's okay. You don't have to make it manually. There's a there's a file. I just don't know where it is. But I'm sure in the doodle bug, I linked the doodle bug. Um, I know we talked about this in the past with Gina and because Gina linked it before in, in like last year. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, you guys. Working but listening. No problem. Love notes. Oh, yes. Love notes. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, so I found this. I found this. Um, it was hiding in my... I have a stash of like jellies from Doodlebug that I found. I was so excited because, you know, some things are for using. Some things are for hoarding. So that's all I'm going to say about that. I don't want to encourage people to hoard. What is inside Brenda? Brenda, Brenda has, well, Brenda can store anything you prefer. Okay, let's start with that. Brenda can, okay, Kayla, Brenda can store whatever you want. I'm thinking, I, I am thinking of putting like, um, I'm thinking of putting like a cookbook inside Brenda wouldn't it be so cute to give like a way to package a cookbook that you're giving using Brenda wouldn't that be so cute especially Mother's Day is coming coming up right I'll share it on sorry I am not I am not um up to date with the chat sorry about that recipe book yes because um this collection you guys I, that's why such it's so the best. I cannot. This collection, okay, this is called Made with Love. It has recipe cards. That's part of the collection. Oh, my God. It's too much. Isn't this so cute to make a to make a recipe card and put it inside Brenda like that? Like a, like a book book, you know? So I think that will be the cutest present ever. 
That would be too cute. If some, just imagine, if somebody gave you that, what would you do? Would you not be super happy? I would be so happy. Heck yes. Like, sign me up. That would be so cute. And then Brenda will be in a part of your kitchen that is protected from splatter. And then that's where you get your cookbook. But make sure that Brenda doesn't get wet because she's not going to like that. Brenda's a prima donna like that, you know. Oh, is it your color, Robin? I'm so glad you like it. I love this color too. Hello, Lana. Happy Friday, girl. What you cooking? What you cooking tonight? I'm not cooking. We're eating leftovers because I have a live. <laughs> On Fridays, I technically normally don't cook either. I cook really early or I order or I pick up. Because I need to make sure that the kids are fed. The kids already had dinner, which is good for you, Christian. You're not such a bad mom. <laughs> so our base is done. Oh my God. So easy. Easy. Now we put the top portion. Top portion is this one. So I'm baking salmon. Ooh, that sounds so good. Making chili. That reminds me, I should make chili because my son loved chili when I made it for the holidays. I heard that like sausage would be so good. Hey guys, don't leave because we have something special in store for you tonight. Thank you, you guys. You guys are so sweet. I need that heart paper in my life. Girl, you need like eight of this. <laughs> in the back part, it says love, love, love. Oh my God. It's so beautiful. I can't. I can't. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. Yes, Christina. Girl, you need this. Everybody needs this heart paper. If I had... Oh, my God. I need to show you guys something. Oh, my God. I had a patient. <laughs> He's 90 years old. He came to the ER for nausea and vomiting, right? So I was discharging him. I just got there. And then he was so sweet. He said, oh, you're such a nice nurse. I'm going to give you a tip. He got me a tip. <laughs> One million dollars. <laughs> How funny is that? Hi, Anna. <laughs> so my patient gave me a tip of $1 million. Isn't he the sweetest? Oh, my God. Okay, scrappy nerd. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for being here. Um, please take care and... I'll talk to you later. Thank you for being here so, so very much. I know my patient is so nice. He's so cute. He's 90 years old. Very sharp. Super sharp. I love him so much. I, what, I Only what I did for him is I just helped, helped. I took his vital signs. I helped him get dressed. Put his socks on, you know. He's so cute. Oh, gosh. I love grandpas. They, have, they hold a special place in my heart. Like when I have um, patients that are like, you know, they're all nice. It's just the old people are just, you know, you can, you empathize and you, you just give them special care. I feel like we all do that. I think so. Good night, Scrappy Nerd. Yay, Kayla's back. What you got for drinks? Anything good? Is it alcoholic, non-alcoholic? Yes, we need to take care of our seniors because they hold the wisdom. They hold the lessons of history. You know? Oh my gosh, Deb. <laughs> so sweet. I should sleep. Wait. Okay, good night, Bex. Thanks for being here. I'm glad. Oh, you guys are so sweet. <clears throat> He's just so cute. And he was so patient because we were... You know, we were waiting for him to get his labs. And he was, like, super nice. We gave him some meal. <clears throat> and then we helped him get dressed and called his wife. Because we don't have visitors in the ER. So we had to make sure that arrangements are made for patients when they go home. And and he, he's so, so nice. He's so nice. I appreciate and he said, like, oh, I'm going to pray for you guys, healthcare workers. Like, oh, my God, Grandpa, if I can hug you, I will. Because we're not allowed to hug anymore. You know, before you can. Ooh, lime, limes with sparkling water and a little sugar. That's it. No tequila, no vodka. What? 
Yes. Cutest part. Is it? I know. Just in case. Isn't that so cute? Like grandpas who are amazing. <laughs> Hi, Alicia girl. Welcome. How are you doing? Happy Friday, Alicia. I know you can't hug because, because of COVID. Like I hug my patients all the time before. And now you can't. You're not allowed. And now we're wearing respirators. So um, I just got my I just got my test. We had a tw test questionnaire for the respirators. Hi, Makas. Happy Friday. Aloha. Hi, Jean. Hello. Air bump. Yeah. Well, for, for older people, it's hard to air bump, you know. It's hard to fist pump. You just want to hug them. And tell them everything is okay. But you can't. And they don't have visitors. It's hard. So, yes. I think it's dependent on the status of your state or your county. Because, you know, the visitor policy changes based on, on like, the level of infection that you, you have, you know. Aloha. Who'd I miss? <laughs> yes. So I can't wait for us to be able to hug again and go to the movies. You know, going to the movies is so awesome. I miss going to the movies. I can't believe that I, I can say that in my lifetime that I miss going to the movies because we took it for granted, I feel like. You know, going to the movies, having a big bucket of popcorn and Diet Coke. Oh, that's an awesome experience. And I love the smell of it. Just asking, are your kids back to school? Yes, they are back in person schooling right now. Imagine how many we could all make. I miss family time. I miss a lot of things. I miss going to the movies. I love the smell of popcorn when you're entering the movie house and and you know you have your own bucket that you're holding i don't like it when you're not you don't have popcorn in your hand and then you smell the popcorn that sucks <laughs> i miss family time i know i miss gathering i miss being with family oh thank you anna it's just so many things so many many things you know Shamani. Okay, so now we're going to put this together. This is the painful part, you guys. But if you endure this painful part, you will be successful. Okay. This is painful. I've already pre-warned you. However, it's okay. Hi, Sydney. Welcome, welcome. I miss traveling too. Oh, my God. Oh, going to a restaurant. I'm too old to miss the bars, but maybe some of you guys miss the bars. I do not specifically. Um, but yes, I miss going to a restaurant, making a reservation. Um, I miss g getting dressed up. This is going to be messy. I miss getting dressed up, shopping. Yeah, ours will open Monday. Wow, yes, that's good. It means that your levels are not bad. Bad moms. I have that in my list. Hi, Mary Bless. Hi, Tita Tess. Thanks for being here. Concerts. Oh, my God. Olga, when are concerts going to be back? I don't know. I don't miss bars. <laughs> I just miss talking to people at random, you know? Because it's hard to talk to people anymore. They look at you funny like, girl, why are you talking to me? Um, Ma'am, I'm not positive. I just got tested last week. <laughs> Anyways, so, anyway, so this is painful and that's okay. Um, it's going to be worth it. I just want to tell you, one at a time, it's going to be fine. I just used, did you notice that I'm using this new technique? I'm just snipping it. It's so much easier than cutting a triangle. Oh, you miss Disneyland? That would be so cute. Did you see someone post? She said, looking forward to walking down the aisle. 
yeah, we took a lot of things for granted. I think when we go back to normal, we are the people who's going to find joy in the small things because it was it was removed. I miss hugging my friends. I know. Jokoy was there, girl. I've been wanting to watch Jokoy. All I have is the Netflix. <laughs> miss yeah i miss disneyland i just the excitement the excitement and prep i just love i just you know we miss everything that's all i'm gonna say and yeah we do i think i think i'm just gonna go i think it was easier I thought it was easier for me to do that. I think it was easier when it's not super thick. So now I know. I have to cut it. But it, this is a mess, but that's okay. It's worth your time, I promise you. What are we talking about? I do too. Yeah, I miss... His first five minutes kept on telling us we are all have COVID now. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I think Jokoy's mom is a nurse because if you're Filipino, you're <laughs> you're expected to be a nurse. <laughs> Look at me. <laughs> Look at me. Look at me now, sister. <laughs> so true. <laughs> uh yeah. <laughs> I'm supposed to be an architect, but that didn't happen. <laughs> Getting time for ourselves, talking to people, spa. Right? A lot of my friends, I get ticklish when I get massages, but my friends who like does spa all the time, they miss that. Like I know. <laughs> yes. I know I saw that in one of the Netflix episodes. It's so funny. <laughs> and then he uses his mom's accent, which is so funny. Oh my god. Jokoy. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> now it became a perfect Paper, paper architect. Oh, that's so sweet, Deb. That's so sweet. Oh my goodness. Where am I? What am I doing? Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. Okay. I think I'm gonna let's start with one, two, three, four. Let's start with five and see how it goes. Let me see Brenda. Yeah, I think four would be good. Let's start with notch number four. Because the freaking <laughs> I saw that comment show. It was funny. It's funny. It's so funny, you know. <laughs> the accent is hilarious. Hilarious. Okay. So eventually, guys, I'm gonna figure out a way for this toaster to be able to accommodate there's an actual opening here eventually i'll figure it out don't worry i promise i'm gonna work on it because my husband says why does your toaster not have an opening it's a weird toaster and what how come so <clears throat> we're gonna work on the handle of the toaster today but oh tara's here hi tata thanks for being here thanks alondra i swear we just ate <laughs> so funny <laughs> wait what yes um bye alondra talk to you later yes we love nouveau drops just left target <laughs> ripped my nail oh no yes oh one more side oh my god this is like a never ending but guys it's worth it just be patient once you see brenda you're gonna be like girl took you forever but i love you brenda you're gonna love brenda and you're gonna put brenda in a special place in your craft room because she's so pretty and it took you hours to make no it, just kidding it's not hours i promise <clears throat> i just talk too much but technically if you really focus on it it doesn't take an hour to be honest oh my gosh I'm so excited. Guys, as soon as I hit 4,000 subscribers, I'm going to give away a Brenda to a lucky wiener. A lucky wiener. And I'm going to put goodies inside. So, yes, stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for that, please. I'm so excited. It's just I need to figure out what box to ship it in because Brenda's so big. 
with her pop tart hanging out as her crown. Do you guys are you guys okay with that? Oh, Eileen is here. Hi, Eileen. Sorry, I'm not looking at the comments. Gosh, you should make a punch triangles. Oh, yeah, I know. Hi, Eileen. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, Crafty Pen Paloma. How are you? Happy Friday. Thanks for being here, you guys. Thank you, thank you. Uh, I need to make sure that my orientation is proper. Hi, Barbara. No problem. Hi, Heidi. Hello, guys. So glad you guys are here today. Um, we are creating Brenda, who is our toaster. And she doubles as a storage. I know I saw Eileen. Oh my god, Eileen. I wanted to go to Walmart when you showed the pen. Gosh. Here I go again. I'm going to be put on a no spend. Oh, M goodness. Mandatory. Mandatory no spend, perhaps. I don't want to do that. That was a huge deal for me. How are you? Hi, Cruz. <laughs> I said hi to Cruz already. <laughs> I know. I'm so glad that our crafty community is getting bigger. And we have new friends. So, do you, are you... I think we're all... We all like getting um, handmade gifts from our friends. But... I want to make it worthwhile to to the winner. <clears throat> so, yes. It's going to be, hopefully, it's going to be okay. You know. I'm adding some score marks. She hides new stash. I need one. Yes. You need a lot of Brenda's, Paula. Multiple Brenda's. <laughs> Hi, Mariposa! Oh my gosh, you're on a no-spend. Girl, girl, if you're on a no-spend, you make Brenda, okay? Because Brenda only needs cardstock. You don't need to spend because I know you already have cardstock in your stash, girl. <clears throat> so Brenda is your handy-dandy, so gorgeous organizer. And you make her using reliable cardstock. And that's it. That's all. That is all. Crayola skin tone. Okay, let me see. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, wait. I made a mistake. <laughs> Talking too much, Christian. Girl, you're talking too much. I knew I made a mistake somewhere. Okay, so this one, you have to attach it here for the opening, okay? So this one, you leave open. Oh, my God, Christian, not paying attention. <clears throat> That's okay. I have my friend Joshua here to help me. Joshua is here, no problem. That's why I'm like, why am I doing this? It's already been pre-planned. Pre I spent over $100 a Tuesday morning and the other day. I'm not proud. <laughs> I might need five Brenda's. <laughs> oh my God, that's so cute. <laughs> Guess found some stuff, huh? What did you find? Is it awesome stuff? Show us, tell us all about it, Kayla. Tell us all about your adventures at Tuesday morning. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's turning out to be so cute. You just have to be really patient. Same as anything that is worth doing. Be patient and it's okay. Just hang out with your friends and have fun. Okay. So now that we're all here, all 90 of us. Does anybody know the name of my daughter? I miss spending $100 a Tuesday morning. Alexa! Yay! Yay! Mimi! You got it! 
Yes, her name is Alexa. And that is a hidden giveaway. Let me show you your prize. Okay, let me show you your prize. You get... I will send it to you. You get these seven... Let me show you. My seven sprink seven of them sprinkle mix. Okay, so you get all these as your prize, Mimi. Congratulations. <laughs> so sorry. It's just like it's just a quick hidden giveaway. So you get all of my mixes. Holy moly. Oh my god. I need to secure that. <laughs> Hi, Leticia. Welcome, welcome. Congratulations, Mimi. It's just it's just a simple giveaway, you know. I remember her name because when you say it, turn, <laughs> it turns Gina's Alexa. That's right. Hi, Lizette. Oh, my God. I'm just talking about you. Girl, hello. Hi, Penny P. Congratulations, Mimi. You will get this prize um, Either in the mail or I, or I deliver it, deliver it to you personally. Okay, congratulations. Anyway, so that was the secret prize for tonight. Um, it's a mix that I made. Let me show you guys what I have. I know I'm distracted again, huh? So these are my mixes from, you know, sprinkles that I have. So this is sprinkle four, five, right there. Now I've used um, Oriel's, I've used um, Oriel's um, shaker element in this one. This one I just reused the packaging because I don't have a container anymore. But this is my favorite. Sprinkles, yeah, we go shopping together. Yes, and then this is the last one. I only have seven customs sprinkle mix. So that one and then this one. This is probably my favorite. <clears throat> and then the pink one is my favorite. Um, thank you. Thank you so much. Um, I, I'm trying to do some simple giveaways. That's not going to break the bank. <clears throat> every so often it's not all the time you know because it's gonna be expensive but i try i try <clears throat> i try to do some um hopefully if I, once i hit four thousand i am gonna be giving a brenda away well you can name it however you want but i'm gonna be giving away a toaster Okay, got distracted again. Sorry, you're not seeing what I'm seeing. Um, There's nothing. Oh, there's nothing good. That sucks. How beautiful. Where did you get that mix? Hi, Lexi. I'm so... I've been collecting sprinkles for a while. And these sprinkles... <clears throat> um, I, I just buy sprinkles because I like to bake. And then... I just mix them together. My latest sprinkle came from Joann's. I normally buy it from Joann's or Michael's and Walmart. So those are the places because they're cost effective. And some of my sprinkles I just found inside my cabinet and they're already expired. So I just play with them. No, they're real sprinkles, but they're expired. So they're like hard because I tasted one of them. <laughs> it's so hard. <laughs> So it's not good for eating. So since it's expired, I figured, you know what? I'll just use them for my crafting. It's very beautiful. It's colorful. And that's what we want. And so, yeah, that's what I did. I think it's cute. <clears throat> yeah, it's real. You can, you can, um... Lick them if you want. <laughs> but Mimi, I wouldn't suggest that because, yeah, definitely I will. I don't recommend that you lick the one that I'm going to send you, okay? I will avoid it if I were you. So, you guys, I know 
I know that our community is getting bigger. The dream is for us to like be in the same hotel together and craft, right? Oh, Gracie. Hello, Gracie. I didn't see you there. Sorry, sorry. Hello, Crafty Paloma. Do you mind reminding me, please, of your name? That would be super awesome. Please, do you coat them in Mod Podge to preserve them? I was just wondering. No, I don't. I just leave them because it's sugar. It's just preserves itself <clears throat> um crafty paloma hi crafty paloma do you mind paloma um telling me your name please it's crafty pen pal <laughs> oh your name okay hello kayla we have two kaylas in the house sorry about that Hi, Kayla. Welcome, welcome. I'm going to put you on the list so I can eventually memorize your name. So don't you think this is so beautiful? Oh my gosh. You guys, thank you for staying with me. I haven't found any good items since Tuesday morning. I wonder why. You know, you wonder, like... I think... Yeah, I've I've had good stuff at my Tuesday morning. However, it's the same now. You know, what I had during Christmas time is the same. I don't know why. To Kayla's in the house. What's your middle initial? V. Are you asking me, Palm? My middle initial is... I don't... In the Philippines, you don't have a middle name. I have a middle initial, which is the maiden name of my mom. So that's how we have middle initials. Oops, I hope I didn't. Okay, almost done, guys. Thanks for being so patient. But I think it's worth it once you see how cute Brenda is. I know it's a pain to kind of construct, but it's absolutely worth it your while it's gonna be gorgeous brenda is gonna keep you company through times of sadness and sorrow really christian i have two middle names what <laughs> Ooh, you are going to tuesday morning with hubby that is the best because that means it's unlimited shopping spree you know when you're with your husband there's no guilt that's the best part, is going with your hubs, I think. Have fun, Eileen. I'm learning. <laughs> is that Brenda high maintenance? <laughs> Hi, Lori. Welcome. I think Brenda is your girl when you want to, like, hide your stash of um, sprinkles. Or if you want to hide your stash of Nouveau Drops that you just bought from urbangems.com <laughs> he's dropping me off oh okay because I've experienced Brenda is so cute she will be like an amazing listener because she's going to be there with you looking at you in your craft room she's just smiling all the time very positive energy my favorite part is decorating Brenda. I am so glad that Lizette is here so we can give her um, the credit that she deserves because Lizette, I hope you're still here. Oh my God, we have 103. Oh my God. Please, please, please send me. <laughs> please send me. A, oh my God, 104. I cannot. <laughs> please send me, um, uh, what do you call that? A screenshot. Oh my Lord. Ugh, so much. Thank you. <laughs> yes, Lisette is here. Thank you so much, Lisette. I use your technique, honey, of the foam. Oh my gosh, Lisette, I use your technique of the foam. Remember your video of like the PV, uh, I don't know what you call it, the PVA foam, the sheets. And then remember you ironed it. What I did, oh, hi, Maria. What I did is I zapped it with a glue gun. And it made it super sturdy. So, so, so cute. Thank you, thank you, Cruz, so much. Oh, my gosh. 105. What? <laughs> oh, my God. This is amazing. Thank you so much. 106. Jeez. Oh, that was a moment. 
Oh, yes, EVA foam. Yes. Thank you. Send me, please, Gracie, send me a link. Oh my God, one or two. So this one, we're going to do this tonight, okay, you guys? We're going to do that. And this is Lizette's. Um, we're going to give her credit. That is her tutorial. I put a link on her tutorial in that video that I made. Um, she gave us a tutorial for it. Super amazing crafter. Super, super amazing. Hi, Melody. Welcome, welcome. Hit the like button, girls. Thank you so much. Urban Gems. Three weeks. Okay, let me get some foam. I think this is going to help out. Okay, so our Brenda is finished. We just need to make the feet. Thank you, Pia. Okay, so let me show you how perfect. Okay, so I'm going to make the face. I'm going to cut the face and then we're going to put flowers, okay? So, this one is a template that I made. So that we can We're going to be making it so quick. Okay, right there. Um, thumbs up. Thank you. Thank you so much, you guys. Let me. Oh my God. Oh my God. Yeah, I love it. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. Thank you for being here, everyone. I appreciate you guys. Um, so uh, for my 4,000 subscriber giveaway, I'm going to give out. I'm going to send you. I'm going to send a lucky winner, her or his own Brenda to your house. And then it's going to have goodies inside for sure that you can put inside there. It's going to be fun and you may like it. Um, good night. Hit the like button. <laughs> Thank you, Lanny. Take care, my friend. Take care, take care. Okay, I think I used, I think I used the wrong punch. This is too big. Okay, this one is one and a half. But I don't have the paper anymore. That's a problem. I already, okay, let's see how that goes. Yes, that is it. Okay, let's do it. Um, we're almost done. You can hide your chocolate stash. You can hide money. Thank you, Christine. Is this a camper? This is a toaster. You can turn it into a camper for sure, Lori. Remember we talked about this, um, if you remember, during springtime last year, 2020. Um, I made this. You can put lights on your camper. Um, I sent one. I know I sent one to Kayla. Yes, yes, yes. I'm so glad that you guys are here hanging out and spending your Friday night. Yes, my mom is here. Support, support. Brenda. <laughs> Brenda is beautiful. And after this, we are going to get flowers. Okay, I'm just going to make it a little bit smoother because I cut it wonky, wonky, wonky. Uh -huh. What doodle bug paper are the hearts? This doodle bug paper is called Made with Love and I got it from 3craftschicks.com, Paula. Thank you, you guys. Yes, my mom's name is Chona. Thank you, thank you so much. I like her a lot. <laughs> I love my mama a lot. She is in Washington. Can't wait to visit her. Okay, so we're putting the eyes. We don't know her name yet. 
but definitely her name is not going to be Brenda. Okay, let me get a punch for white. Let me just punch white paper. Super simple. It's a beautiful collection, is it not, Mariposa? Yes, so cute. I love, love this collection so much. It is, I think it is my favorite collection of all time, of all time. Hi, Shirlene, welcome. Mama Tina says hi. Mom, um, Christina's mom, her name is Tina. And she watches my live too. Mama Tina watches too. Isn't that so sweet? So hopefully, Christina, I will meet you when I go visit my mom. Who else did I miss that hopped on? Oh, Charlene is here and I said hi. You know what? Wouldn't it be so amazing to like see each other in person? And then I have a smile. This is just a letter O. This is just a letter O in one of my die cuts and I just snipped it. You know, I'm sure you have a letter O in your... um collection of dies and that's the, that's how I used it I just uh I just have a letter O and I cut it into half and that's it with made with love packages being held hostage by UPS oh no are you serious 20 miles why oh because of the snow we didn't have snow Oh my goodness, that's so horrible. Okay, right here. I'm just using my wet glue for now. And then after we see her cute face, we can decide um, what to name her. Oh my God, she's too cute. So cute. away since Christmas that is horrid that is horrible Tasha the toaster oh that's genius Robin let's name her Tasha that's a beautiful name oh my god we have Tasha in the house hello Tasha how are you I have a good friend her name is Tasha too <laughs> Tasha the toaster is adorable that's genius <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay, this is Tasha, everyone. She's so beautiful. And we are going to put flowers on Tasha for sure. And we're going to put the side handle of her. Um, of her. I don't know what it's just called. Like the handlebars. Tasha, simply adorable. What a great name. Robin, thank you so much. <laughs> what a cute name. Tasha the Toaster, yes. Yes, 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 honey. Tasha the Toaster. Pure genius. Okay, so let me put Tasha's um, side panel. I don't know what it is called. <laughs> listening, and, listening and crafting. <laughs> Thank you, Kayla. So this is Tasha, you guys. I'd like you to meet Tasha. And I am working on Tasha's handlebars. That doesn't sound good. <laughs> Hashtag Tasha Toaster. Yes, so cute. <laughs> we have Brenda and Tasha in the house. And I think this is the most, this is the most perfect, the most perfect flare in the world because it has a toaster. This is from Bona, you guys. If you want to order just toaster images, you can. Tasha's handlebars. <laughs> I know, right? It doesn't sound good. <laughs> Hi, Noreen. Welcome. Happy Friday. <laughs> yeah, we have to get a girlier way. Yes, Lana. Thank you so much. It was 106 earlier. Oh, my gosh. So we have to figure out a way to kind of like have a better way to talk about Tasha's 
handlebars. It's not very um, ladylike, isn't it? It's not very girly, if we call it Tasha's handlebars. Maybe we can figure out a way to... Um, love handles? Love handles will be cute. Yay! Thank you, thank you, Kayla. Please send it to me. Because the 106 was very fleeting. <clears throat> thank you, thank you, Bonnie. <coughs> Lori, thanks for thank you for being here. Good night, my friend. We're almost done. I just need to put um Tasha's love handles. Um, thank you, Cruz. Thank you, thank you. I'm I'm just waiting. No, oh my god, this is not gonna work. Nope. I really need to do some engineering work with this one. Like actually measure her side handlebars no side love handles okay love handles drink water alicia oh my gosh thank god you're here oh my gosh wow olympia tena there's a potential that we can all meet there when when i visit my mom oh my goodness because christine is also close to you Good night, Lori. Have a great weekend. Christina, yes. You, go, you guys are neighbors. You and my mom. Because my mom is in Federal Way. Shez. Oh, my God. Let's meet. I'm right outside of Seattle. Oh, my God. Let's do it. Crafty. What do you call that? Crafty meetup. Yes. Let's go. Crafty Meetup, Seattle version, Washington version. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, honey. <laughs> oh, it's going to be so much fun. Oh, my gosh. Let me know. Well, I'll let you guys know. <laughs> I have an earache. Oh, no. Oh, we have to meet. We have to meet. Oh, wait. Sydney's leaving. Sydney, good night. Thanks for being here. That would be so awesome. That would be amazing for us to have a crafty meetup when when we visit my mom. I don't know when. I need to talk to my husband. I'm waiting for my vacation to get approved. Crafty session, Washington. Here we go. Oh, okay. Somebody said goodbye, Rose. I thought it was you, Sydney. Okay, let's see. Oh, my gosh. Okay, I'm going to twist this around to make the shorter handle. Okay, I'm not sure. I'm just experimenting because I thought about this idea like seven minutes before the live. So I'm not sure if this is actually going to work, you guys. I'm hoping that it will. And if it doesn't, we're going to go back to the drawing boards. Okay, let's see. We're going to go back to the drawing boards. If it doesn't work... Then we'll go at it again next time. So all I want to do is... Okay, let me wait for this to dry. Go ahead, humidifier. Bye, Pia! You can curl the bread ends. Can you curl the bread ends? I just cut it. Cruz, I just cut it, look. I just cut it, and then I put some foam to give it a little bit of height. And what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to have it go up and down. But that doesn't stop me from twisting it. Oh, well. Oh, well. It was worth a shot. <laughs> it is worth a shot. We'll see how it goes. I hope it works. Because this is Tasha's love handles. And I want her to have the most beautiful love handles ever made in history. Because Tasha is so beautiful. Oh my god, I cannot. What? It works! Oh my goodness. Oh, but it's gonna it's kind of trying to come out. But it works. Oh my god. Jules is gonna be so happy. Jules is my husband's name, you guys. Oh, he's gonna be so happy that I was able to make it functioning. Put a penny. Oh my god. Put a penny. 
Do I have a penny? That, yeah. Oh my god, my next one, I'm gonna put a penny. The love handles. It's coming off, but it works. The next time, I'm gonna do the penny business because it's already attached. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Now let's put her face right here, Tasha. Need to make sure that... Oh my god, I put it in the wrong area. Okay, I'm going to put Tasha's handle on this side. Because look, my print is here. That's okay. I can put Tasha's um, love handles on the left. Okay, um, Lizette... So glad that you're here. I was binge watching your tutorials. <laughs> I'm such a huge fan. <laughs> there, yes, there is a tutorial and there's a link in the description box for you, Miss Lori. Tasha, welcome to the world. Tasha the Toaster, hashtag PHA2021 Tasha the Toaster. Hi, Veronica. <laughs> right there oh my god oh my gosh now i'm so excited to show you guys this technique which is from my friend lizette she's a genius period let me put this stuff away because it's gonna drive my insane okay let's clean up our table so we don't go bonkers and let's play with this one okay now tasha Tasha wants her flowers, okay? This is Tasha. Tasha wants her flowers. We're going to put Tasha's feet after we decorate her with some flowers, okay? I've pre-made some of these, and these are just foam. There's, there's EV, they're called EVA foam, and they are so, so cute and cost-effective. Look at that. And I've cut a boatload of them in here. When you zap him, Tasha the Toaster, so cute. Such a cute name for her. Thank you, Barbara. <laughs> She's so cute. Okay. We love Tasha. We know that. Definitely, Tasha deserves beautiful flowers for her hair. I think I'm going to put it on the right side this time, just to give it a little bit of variety. Um, and so this technique, you just cut your, you cut your foam, okay? So I just use my die cut because you, I tried to put it inside like a puncher. It didn't work. So you get your die cutting machine and cut some flowers. And we're going to use our, okay, we're going to use, um, we're going to use this one, okay? We're going to, we're going to zap it with our heat tool, I'm going to get my glue gun. Sorry about the noise, you guys. Okay. Foam. Yes, they are store-bought. Oh, no. they These are like foam that you get from the Dollar Tree. Okay. So you hold this like this. I hope you can see this. Oh, what did I do? Guys, um, make sure you watch Lizette. Make sure you watch Lizette's tutorial because she irons them. I'm too lazy to get the ironing board. But her technique is absolutely genius. Okay. And so at this point, this material is highly pliable. You can negotiate whatever shape you want it to have. See? I don't like the ironing board because it's so big. Liz, yes. Um, right there. This, and then it's, it's going to be sturdy. Um, can any of the moderators link Lizette's um, channel, please? So everybody can check out her tutorial. It's amazing. I just, it's a huge regret that I don't have a yellow, um, yellow foam. That's a huge regret. Probably I'll get it. I'll get some tomorrow because I'm off tomorrow. But look how cute that is. It's so simple. Let's do another one so you can see how amazing, what amazing technique it is. I'd rather do it this way. 
Um, so it, j you just get your zap zapping tool, your heat gun. You know, like what we did with our... But it's Lizette's idea. Thank you so much, Lizette. Yes, I use a hair straightener too. Let's try that. I use a hair straightener too. Um, but the heat, the heat glue gun, the, sorry, the heat, the glue gun, the, oh God, the embossing tool is always, always in my craft table. This one I had to get from my bathroom and I have to have it on a silicone mat. And unfortunately, my silicone mat had so much embossing powder on it. That's why I'm like, no, I'm done with this. What's her channel? Yes. Cousin Sandra, thank you so much for the link. Your work is fabulous, Christian. Yes, your work is fabulous. What are you talking about, Lizette? This is all about you. This is your idea. I'm just featuring it and showing everyone your amazing idea. Thank you so much, Lizette. We want to feature you. You're an amazing crafter. Thank you so much for inspiring us. Put it on the lowest setting first. Look at that. And then it becomes, it becomes like at this point, it's still pliable because it's warm. And after it's cooled down, you guys, it's going to be sturdy and it's so cute. I want you to try this because this foam is available in your Dollar Tree. No joke. No, it, for reals. It is available in your, in your Dollar Tree right now. So, Tasha will be so ready for her party right now because, um, let's see if this is warm already. Let's try. I know this works because I saw it on, um, see, see, it's curving right now. Isn't that awesome? It's just scary to work with, but it does the same thing. You heat it up, either a curling iron, the crafty thickness, right? So this one is 2 mm. Oh my god, it's so cute. So you just move it around the curling iron and then it's done. See, so easy, you guys. So much fun to do. Either a curling iron, put mine on hot iron. Yes. So anything that you have, if you don't have an iron, you can have a hair, hair iron, an actual iron, or a glue gun. Whatever you have. Electric coffee cup. Oh my god, that's a great idea. Electric coffee cup warmer. That's genius. I used to have those. So cute and easy. If you don't have an embossing tool, you can borrow, go to your bathroom and, and get it. So cute. So easy technique, you guys. Yeah, that's genius, Lori. That's a great idea. But I want to make sure that we recognize um, you can curl the foam strips with your curling iron. Oh, you can? That's insane. Oh my God, Lizette. Like, I love this crafty community because we share so much with each other. But I want to make sure that we give credit to Miss Lizette because this is her idea. I've made the giant foam flowers. Oh my gosh. Did you did you use the iron on Veronica? So easy. Oh my god. The kids would love these. Like my daughter, I was thinking they can play with this. Um, you know, they don't call it play dates anymore when they're 12. They call it hanging out. It used to be called play dates. Now they're just hanging out. Okay. So when they hang out, I want to give them some supplies so they can play with it. Hopefully, they don't burn themselves. So, isn't this so cute and economical? I use a heat. Oh, you use a heat tool. Yes. That's also an option. I think either way, the concept pretty much is being able to put heat, applying heat, and then it, it becomes malleable. Um, it's such an amazing amazing idea and it's so cost effective because you can find this at the dollar tree yay thank you so much yes support support um i love 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 this it's such a great idea it's so thank you thank you for subscribing 
cute, right, you guys? And you can see it transforming right in front of your eyes. So easy. I can I was like so looking forward to this moment when we feature this foam. Hi, Cindy, you made it. Thank you for being here, Cindy. Hello. How are you? We're playing with foam and we're playing with a curl, you know, a straightening tool for your hair. <laughs> So that's what we're doing right now. We're just, um, we're playing with this one. We're waiting for it to curl so that we, we made a toaster. Her name is Tasha. I'll show her. I'll show you, Cindy, I'll show you Tasha. What did you use for flowers? Oh, this one is called, you know, the foam sheets that you get from the Dollar Tree or from your local supply store. Like you can even find this at Walmart. It's um, foam sheets, super inexpensive. They come in a variety of colors. And yeah, so, so amazing. You just put it on a curling iron and you make it. I'm trying to amuse myself before I wash the sink. Oh no, Pom. <laughs> yes, <laughs> that is so not fun. Okay, so look. Look how beautiful. Okay, so that's the curling iron portion. And then we can put, we can put, it's like foam on foam. I was watching a movie while I was cutting it. Isn't this so pretty? The coffee cup warmer is good for your daughter. Yes, that's a great idea. I need to get a coffee cup. That would be so cute for her crafty. Tomorrow's my crafty party. Crafty party day. How wonderful. Isn't it so pretty, Alicia? You like it? I thought it was so genius. I'm like, oh my God. I'm going to feature Lizette's genius idea on a Friday live. I think this is too big, don't you think? Yeah, that's too big. I think this is cute together. Um, I need to find a small, I think this one would be so cute. <sighs> Love those. Oh, just imagine you guys, if it's going to be, if you're going to make a toaster for spring, it could have butterflies and flowers. Wouldn't that be so cute? Butterflies and flowers will be your decoration. I think that will be adorable. Butterflies on like your toaster. I've been watching and listening since pretty much since the beginning. What dies did you use? Um, I used um, a Sizzix die for this. It's an old, old, old die that I've had. Um, this one is called Flower Layers number 15. And it's item number 659789. But you can always find these dies in AliExpress. Um, oh, Tasha needs a bow. Yes, she does. So cute. I need to have a blue somehow here somewhere. Um, But my blue is too big. Yeah, I think that's good. Give Tasha a bow. Yes, for Easter you can put ears and bows. You can put, oh, you can put like fireworks or like you know, those noisemakers for July 4th. Halloween. Oh, my God. We can put bats on Tasha if she's, like, getting dressed for Halloween. That would be so cute. Oh, my goodness. It's too much. Tasha is too cute. I cannot. So, let's attach Tasha. Tasha's flowers to make it, to make it official. I think Tasha is gorgeous. Tasha is just gorgeous. And look how pretty Tasha's hair is. Hubby's is driving me. Oh, wow. You have a crafty party. That's amazing. Oh, my goodness. I joined late. Are the... Are there drawers in the toaster? Um, hi, Melissa. Hello, hello. So, Lana, 
the toaster. This is, her name is Tasha, okay? But we have Brenda. Brenda is the first toaster that we featured in this channel. Let me show you Brenda because Tasha's not done yet. Um, Patricia, thank you. Thank you for being here and have a wonderful, wonderful weekend. So this is what Brenda has inside. She has so much space. You can put so many things. You can even put like memory decks cards inside. Okay, super, super cute. There's so much space in there. Um, and you can create it however you want. Okay, so now we're almost done. We're, I'm just going to show you how to make the feet. And we are done. Um, oh, yeah, I have... Oh, oh, no, I need to make this better. I'm going to do... I'm just going to attach this here. I think I need to do the penny technique. What I'm doing right now is I'm just gluing Tasha's... I'm just gluing Tasha's love handles with glue, but in the next in the next um, toaster that I make, it's going to be it's going to move. Good night, Maria. Good night. Good night. Good night. Yes, Carol. That's what Lori was saying. A wax warmer. That's what she was saying. It would be safer for for the girls. That would be so much safer, wouldn't it? Um, okay, so we're just going to make, we're just going to put together the feet, which is super easy. You just fold it like this. How do you do the Pop-Tarts from felt? Um, oh, I will, I'll do a separate tutorial on that, Lori, because, um, yeah, I'll do a separate tutorial, but I definitely use felt with it. I just layer, I just layer them, like make it a square, and then that's it. But I'll do a separate tutorial for you, I promise. Hello, everyone. Hi, Sandra. Hello. Welcome. Happy Friday. We are making the feet, and this is our toaster. Her name is Tasha. We're making her feet for the bottom. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just making her feet. I'm just um, snipping away her feet. I'm just doing some factory mode work right here. Okay. Just a moment. I am almost done, you guys. Thank you for staying with me all throughout tonight. Thank you. I always appreciate you guys hanging out. I, I look forward to this. When I'm at work, I'm like, I cannot wait. I can't wait to craft, to hang out with my crafty friends. I just absolutely appreciate your friendship and you being here. Uh, Christian, where did you find the felt? Oh, Em, I found the felt in um, Hobby Lobby. They have so many amazing colors in Hobby Lobby compared to Michael's and Joanne's. Hobby Lobby has more, like, they have the lighter pink. They have the peach in Hobby Lobby also. So they have more, more amazing colors. So, however, you can also find in some Dollar Tree, they have felt there as well. So, yes. Okay, let me trim this. Okay, so this is the feet. This is Tasha's feet, okay? I subscribe to you, Lizette. Hooray! Yes, Tasha can have different outfits. Um, you can make your own toaster for whatever season you prefer. Whatever gift, giving, holiday that you have. If, you, if it's Mother's Day, springtime, summer. You can do... Like a popsicle. No, I don't think so. I think a toaster is going to be a toaster. But they can have different themes. Like volleyball. Different colors. Um, you know, different accent pieces. You can do a Hawaiian themed Tasha. 
I read the other day that Hobby Lobby is stopping. I heard that. End of February. Isn't that horrible? Ugh. That's so horrible. I think it's so not cool. Because their prices are a little bit expensive. Yes, they sell at Walmart too. That's right, Palm. That's a great idea. Kayla, I was confused for a minute. Sorry. Sorry, Cousin Sandra. Was I confusing? Um, it stinks. They will lose. Uh, yeah, they will lose a lot of business. Sorry, I'm trying to like look at this and um, work on on all the stuff. I want to switch this off because I do not want to get burned. So we're going to put this on Tasha's feet. Let me get... I put some decorative elements on it. <clears throat> What's happening at Hobby Lobby? Oh, Bobby. Hobby Lobby is now removing their coupon so at the end of february they don't have 40 percent off anymore i don't think i think hobby lobby has better deals than michael's yeah michael's is the worst honestly you guys isn't it like they are the worst when it comes to deals what happened to them they always had coupons before but i think the business side of michael's because of the pandemic um, you know, they don't have more sales. I think they, you would think that they've increased their sales because everybody's crafting. I don't know. To get to Hobby Lobby. Yes, it's going away. They say the prices will change without coupon, but we shall see. Oh, hopefully, hopefully, right? Oh, no. Oh, no, they close. I can't believe that. I heard that they're removing coupons so they can have less prices all around the store. Okay, that's wonderful then. Because I like their frames and everything. Um, my daughter will be going to Hobby Lobby to get some frames for her room. Yeah, they will honor coupons. It's because of the pandemic. Yep. Yep. Everything is because of the pandemic. Okay, I'm just putting a decorative portion for Tasha. And I use the, um, what do you call that? The barcode strip. Because they have samples, so I use that. Because I want to hoard this paper collection so badly. Oh my god, this is too cute. I think this toaster is so cute. And you know who inspired me with this is Jen B. You guys, make sure that you follow her. She is crazy. Crazy amazing. Because she makes the most ridiculously amazing, I swear to god. The most ridiculously amazing 3D projects. She, um... And she is also part of the Doodlebug design team. Um, Jen Beeson. Jennifer Beeson. Your toaster makes me smile. Thank you. Thank you so much. That is so sweet. <laughs> that is so sweet. Melissa, thank you so much. That makes me happy. Um, her name is Tasha, by the way. And Tasha likes pina coladas. And walks in the park. She likes, um, yeah. She likes pina coladas. And her favorite color is yellow. Yes, honey, yes. I've never heard of that. Wait, what? One in the Bronx and one in Manhattan. But not the main one in Manhattan. What's Jen's channel? I don't think she has a YouTube channel. She has Instagram. Um, if you look at my video. Yes, Robin. You won the name challenge. Her name is Tasha now. 
Well, everybody loved the name, so nobody really contested it. <laughs> so, yes. Pina coladas and getting caught in the rain. So cute. And now, the last portion is being able to put... I've already pre-cut the toast. And so, this is going to be Tasha's friend. And her name is Robin. <laughs> this is Robin the Pop-Tart. And this is Tasha. Okay, Robin. Because you named Tasha... The Pop-Tart is named after you. So cute. Oh, my God. Let me see. Da, da, da. Da, 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 da. Remember me. I'm following her. She is Jen. Yes. Don't you love her? I love her so much. Oh, my God. Robin the Pop-Tart. <laughs> and Robin loves blue. This is her color. So, yes, Robin. This is Robin the Pop-Tart, and she is keeping their besties. Tasha and Robin are besties. I think I love Pop-Tart as much as a toaster. <laughs> Her projects are legit. And when I say legit, I mean like ridiculously amazing. You are going to be inspired in making your own. Like she, her project inspired me to create so many 3D because... Hers are SVG, but it's just so encouraging. It's so amazing. I'm going to put you up top a little bit. So follow her. She's amazing. The toaster love story. That's so cute. Okay, so this is Robin, the Pop-Tart, and this is Tasha. Oh, my God. They're so cute. I cannot. Okay, I think it's missing something. Let me just give Tasha one more flower here. And then I'll use Nouveau Drops. Okay. So let me get a sticker. Let me get a sticker real quick. La -da -da -da. We're almost done. Oh my God. Thank you guys for all of you who stayed with me. Thank you so much. I think Tasha will have this to kind of Okay. Oh my god, this is too much. This is too pretty. Okay. Oh my god. Tasha is so beautiful and she is with her bestie Robin. And they both go to Hobby Lobby together. Their favorite colors are yellow and and aqua, of course. And their neighbors, too. Oh, my battery's dying. Oh, no. Well, thank you so much for being here, Kayla. I think it's more challenging to do manual. Yes, because you have to measure. But there is a, a an SVG file for this, guys. There's an SVG file if you don't feel like you want to make it manually. There's an SVG file so that you can cut it using your cutting machine. Um, Christian, your creation is even cuter and more alive than Doodlebug Paper Collection. Oh my gosh, Palm, you are so sweet, my friend. Good night, Kayla. How cute is that toaster? Thank you, Christine. Thank you, thank you. Thanks. Is that your IG handle? Does a Pop-Tart need bead? behind it to make it stable um it hasn't no the two pop tarts that is on top of brenda it they haven't no they're fine they're hanging out they're partying up there so um yeah they're okay i just use a boatload of uh, glue gun oh my gosh cindy you are so so sweet oh my god my grandson made me watch coco today i love that song <laughs> remember me yes I love that song. I I like watching Coco. You gotta make something. You gotta make something and call it Christian the Enabler. <laughs> so funny, Bonnie. <laughs> oh my God. Here we go. We are attaching Rob. Robin, this is you. So I'm being very, very generous, as you can see, with my glue gun. Okay, be very generous with your glue gun. Don't be shy. 
and you have to hold Robin steady until she's ready to be let go, okay? Hold Robin steady until she's ready to be free. That's overkill. Hold it, and then I would put an extra layer of glue gun in the back. Robin got burned. Oh, no. Bye, Olga. Did, is Olga saying goodbye? Bye, Olga. Cousin Olga. Thanks for being here, friend. Okay. Now Robin is standing up. I'm going to put an additional layer of glue gun behind Robin so that she can be extra stable. There you go. So that's going to make Robin really, really stable and attached to her bestie, Tasha. Okay. Um, I don't feel super bad failing on the love handle. I know that I'm going to still be making three more of this. And hopefully before all those three are done, I'll be able to figure it out. I forgot I'm cousin Christian. Yes, cousin Bonnie. What are you talking about? Yes, we're cousins. Cousin Bonnie, you forgot about it, I think. Um, so I love this paper collection. I just cannot tell you how much I love it. I love it so very much. I love it so much, I don't want to use it. <laughs> Does that make sense? Yes. Oh, Gina. Gina, Gina, good night. Good night, my cousin Gina. Oh my gosh. Look at Robin standing proud. Yes, honey. Oh my God. We are done. We are done. We're done. Oh my God. Do we like it? Okay. Now, I am so happy to present to you, everybody, I'd like you to meet Tasha and her best friend Robin up there. Robin the Pop-Tart and Tasha the Toaster. They are besties. They love pina coladas and their favorite color is yellow and they go to Hobby Lobby together. Okay. So cute. They're absolutely gorgeous they are just too cute for words um i think it would be if i had yellow flowers but i don't have it so that's okay i am in love too oh my god thank you so much everyone for the support i just love them and then brenda is here to support brenda is like an older cousin and she's a little bit more experienced in life when it comes to dealing with toaster adversities, you know, whatever toasters experience in their lives. But they're both so cute and they're both using the Made With Love collection. <laughs> Toasterific! <laughs> Mama Tina so smart. <laughs> oh my God, so crafty. Okay, so the tutorial is there for you guys. Thank you so, so, so much for being here. And we hit a record of 106. I am so excited about that. I'm so happy. Thank you all for being here with us. Um, once I hit 4,000, somebody will be getting a toaster mailed to their homies. Mail, mail, mail to their home. <laughs> toaster adversities. Yes, honey. <laughs> toaster adversities. Cruz, you're so funny. <laughs> Mama Tina. Mama Tina so cute. Um... Oh my god, thank you guys so much for being here. Oh, if you're inspired to make one, please share with Christian. Yes, tag me, please. We're going to use the hashtag. What do we use? Hashtag PHA 2021 3D toaster, just to make it simple. Okay, let's use all this year, let's use hashtag PHA 2021 as our standard. And then 3D toaster. So please, please, please um, tag me if you're making one. I would be so, so excited to see what you made. And what is the name? Don't forget to put the name of your toaster so we get to meet them. 
Good night, everybody. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for all the thumbs up, you guys. I really, really feel the love. Um, and thank you, guys. Have an amazing, amazing, amazing weekend. Oh, toaster. 3D. 3D. 3D toaster. Um, thank you so much. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you, my mods, for being amazing. Thank you, everyone, for being here. Hi, Deborah. I didn't see you. Hello, Deborah. And goodbye, Deborah. Sorry, I don't think I said hi to you. Thank you so much, Lizette, for your amazing, amazing ideas. I appreciate you. Thank you. Take care, everyone. Have a wonderful, crafty day. This is Christian signing off. Have a great weekend. Bye, guys. Love ya.